in the shimmering depths of the ocean, where coral gardens danced and sunlight peeked through, there lived a tiny, beautiful fish named Finny. Finny was as bright as a rainbow, with scales that shimmered like a thousand stars. She loved to dart and weave through the water, exploring the nooks and crannies of her underwater kingdom. One sunny day, as Finny chased a school of tiny bubbles, she found herself drawn into a mysterious cave. Its entrance was hidden behind a curtain of waving seaweed, and Finna's curiosity got the better of her. She couldn't resist swimming inside. At first, the cave was dark and shadowy, and Finny felt a little scared. But as her eyes adjusted, she noticed something amazing. The walls of the cave were covered in glowing crystals that lit up the darkness like a thousand tiny lanterns. Finny couldn't help but gasp in wonder. Wow! She exclaimed. This is so beautiful. Finny swam deeper into the cave, marveling at the sparkling crystals. She had never seen anything so magical. Suddenly, she realized that she was lost. The cave was so large and confusing, and Finny couldn't find her way back to the sunlight. Panic began to set in. Finny swam around frantically, but the cave just kept getting bigger and darker. She was all alone, and she didn't know what to do. Tears began to stream down Finna's face. She curled up into a tiny ball on the cave floor, feeling lost and scared. But just when all hope seemed lost, Finny heard a faint sound. It was a gentle clicking noise, like someone tapping their fingers together. Finny looked up and saw a tiny, glowing creature swimming towards her. It was a baby sea turtle, with big, curious eyes and a friendly smile. Hello, said the sea turtle. What's wrong? I'm lost, sobbed Finny. I can't find my way back home. Don't worry, said the sea turtle. I can help you. I know this cave like the back of my fin. The sea turtle led Finny through the winding tunnels of the cave, carefully avoiding the sharp rocks and dark corners. Finally, they reached the entrance, where sunlight streamed in like a golden waterfall. Finny swam out of the cave and into the open ocean, where she had left her family and friends. She was so relieved to be back in the sunlight, and she couldn't thank the baby sea turtle enough. Thank you for saving me, she said. I'm so grateful. You're welcome, said the sea turtle. Remember, even in the darkest of times, there is always hope. And sometimes, the best friends are found in the most unexpected places. And so, Finny returned to her family and friends, telling them the story of her adventure in the underwater cave. From that day on, she never forgot the baby sea turtle who helped her find her way home. And she also knew that even in the most frightening of situations, there is always hope to be found, if you just keep swimming.